Hey there, and welcome to another Ad Skills tutorial. In this video, I'm going to share how we use what's called the master negative list script inside of AdWords to automatically place all of our negative keywords and blacklist placements to all of our campaigns across all of our MCC accounts with one click of the button. It is awesome. Please make sure that you pay attention. So if you've never seen an Ad Skills video before, I just wanted to say welcome. My name is John Belcher. I'm the teacher here at Ad Skills, and we're super excited to have you. So in this video, we're talking about a script, which I know can sound a little bit scary. Sounds like you have to be able to code. You don't. You'll be just fine. I don't know how to code. All I know how to do is copy and paste and follow instructions. That's all you need to know how to do. So this script is going to help you take your blacklist. So those are all of the negative keywords and sites that you do not want to advertise on and add those to all of your new campaigns. So you'll be able to tell all of your search campaigns, do not advertise on these all of your GDN campaigns, I don't want to advertise on these keywords or these placements. That is a huge advantage because it helps you stop wasting money on things you've already proven that don't work. And to give you a little idea, so inside of our Bulletproof GDN course, which exists both in our Google pathway and our mass market pathway, we've given you access to our 65,000 site blacklist. That's taken a ton of time and effort to, sp to spend money and figure out which sites aren't working. We're giving you all that work to help you go through and shorten your learning curve. That's why this is so awesome. So these scripts help you shorten your learning curve because you build the script that you're on one time. It gives you a leg up on learning. You don't have to spend any money on those sites because you know they don't work. And finally, this works across all of your accounts inside of your MCC, which makes life so much easier. So what do you need to make this work? Well, you have to have a Google AdWords account and access to the AdWords script library, which is totally free, so very easy. Steps of the process. First, we're gonna set up our master negative list. Then we're gonna copy our script into our account, place a spreadsheet link within the script, and then run the script. So the first place I'm gonna begin is by typing in AdWords script library. So this will pop up, and you wanna click on the one that says AdWords script Google developers. And then what you're gonna do is click on solutions. So you'll see in here you've got single account scripts and manager accounts. If you've got an MCC, you want to make sure you use this one. I'm going to use a single account because I'm using our example account. So I'll come down here to master negative list. I'll click on that. And inside of here, there's really two things you do. So the first thing I'm going to do is click on this and make a copy of this spreadsheet. So I need to come in here and make a copy and it'll open up a Google Doc. And then second thing, we're going to grab this code URL and then copy our spreadsheet URL into the code once we've set it up. So let's go through and set up our spreadsheet first. So this is the template that they give you. You come in here, you can add your account ID, so the 10 digit number of your AdWords account or MCC in here. Um, then we'll, I'll walk you through these steps. So label for the campaign to be processed. If you leave this blank, it's gonna add your blacklist to every single campaign. If you put in something specific, so sometimes we'll use stuff like GDN blacklist applied. If you add those two specific campaigns, it'll go through and look for that label and apply it only to those campaigns. Um, name for, neg for key master negative keywords, master negative placements, your email address. You just wanna put in the email address that you want an email sent to once your script is finished running. So I'll add mine in there. If you have an MCC account, you're gonna have one more box which will ask you which customer IDs do you wanna apply this to. If you want it to be everyone, you leave it blank. If you only want it to be specific accounts, you put those in there. So that's your basic setup. Then you've got down here two more tabs, keywords and placements. I'm just going to come in here and put in test.com. That's the only placement I'm going to utilize. Once again, if you get our Bulletproof GDN course, we've got 65,000 placements. They're, they're sites that we've proven don't work, and they're, you're going to get access to them as well. So, um, all right, now we've got our spreadsheet set up. So I'm going to copy, first of all, I'm going to come back here. I'm going to copy this script, head into AdWords. And you clicked on the wrench and then you go to scripts and you'll be in here. You want to click plus. We're going to have a new script. And so you can go through and name these whatever you want to. Um, you know, the big thing in here is just making sure that you copy this appropriately and you really follow the instructions that the uh, AdWords script library tells you to follow. So I'm just going to call this example blacklist script. As you can see here, there's a function in here. That's if you write code. I don't. So I'm just going to copy that in there. The one thing I want to bring your attention to, so right here, line 42, variable spreadsheet URL, insert spreadsheet URL. So you want to come back here, copy this, come into this, and you want to leave the single quotations and paste that in the middle. That's all you need to do. So uh, once again, I'm just going to uh, come back here, click save. And as you'll see, there's this yellow box right here. I need to authorize this to run. So you have to do an authorization with your Google account to allow this to run. 
And you're actually going to have to do this twice. I have to authorize this one down here. So now that we've got this authorized, I've clicked Save. I'm just going to preview this. So I want to make sure it runs, see if we've got anything that's going to be a problem. Looks like it's run successfully across our ad sets. So I don't really have any campaigns in this account. So just to set expectations, I put one negative placement in for basically zero campaigns. So it took virtually no time for this to run. If you have an account with a lot of campaigns, or if you're using our 65,000 sites uh, blacklist, it's going to take a long time to apply this to all of your campaigns. So the expectations correctly, this was very fast here for this tutorial. It's going to take you a while to do this in real life. Um, the other thing here is I clicked preview, so I always want to make sure I see if there's any mistakes that have happened along the way. If there's anything that has been uh, an error, it will pop it up and I can go through and fix it. Once I've shown the preview work successfully, then I click run and go through and apply it to all those campaigns and accounts. So really that's all you have to do. Once again, this will shorten your learning curve and help you really cut up, trim all the fat before you start running your campaigns to make sure you're only testing your budget on stuff that you actually think can produce results for your business. So if you have any questions about this, feel free to leave comments down below. I try and answer YouTube comments as often as I can. But if you really want some help, make sure to check out our Pro League forum. That's where you can ask Justin Brooke and myself and a bunch of other media buyers questions about AdWords, Facebook, Twitter, Native, LinkedIn, all the different things that you could be using to, to get traffic. Uh, you have the ability to come in and ask us specifics about your business. So if you found this tutorial helpful and want to learn more about how to effectively advertise on Google, make sure to check out our Google Ads pathway. It includes our Bulletproof YouTube ads, Bulletproof AdWords ads, and Bulletproof GDN ads courses. And honestly, it's the culmination of my experience when I worked at Google, my time with clients afterwards, and Justin's experience with clients is all wrapped into one. If you want to be successful advertising on Google, this is the number one resource that will help you do it. And if you like free stuff, don't forget to check out the Ad Skills Quarterly Giveaway. The link is in the description. If you like free stuff like Amazon gift cards, Barnes & Noble gift cards, Xbox, PlayStation, even Bose headphones, make sure to check it out. We give away stuff every quarter, and all you have to do to enter is subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, little things like that. So don't forget to head over there and enter yourself for a chance to win. Thanks so much, and have an awesome day.